Is it a missed opportunity that you can't get back? Or is there just a little bit of a chance that he's still thinking about her? Because June was hanging out with this dude uh, in the spring for a while. She thought he was a great guy, just not her type, you know? So she lets him go. And now she's like, hmm, maybe he was my type. <laughs> <laughs> Spoiler alert, no. If he wasn't your type to begin with, things didn't change. Well... I, don't you think that, like, over the course no. of, like, no. No. <laughs> <laughs> hey, June. Hey, good morning. Abby says that there's absolutely no chance that this guy's going to be interested in you. He, nothing's changed, and we shouldn't even do this. If you thought he was ugly before, he's still ugly now. <laughs> Spoiler alert. <laughs> All right, so tell us I about you. Mad. Tell us about you going out with this dude in the spring, why you cut him loose, and why now you're thinking, like, oh, that was stupid. Yeah, so I'm pretty outgoing, end up meeting this guy named Zach. Um, we went out twice, he planned the dates, they were really fun actually. Um, but I think at the time he was introverted and, you know, he seemed like a great guy, but it, I just couldn't see us together. Like, again, not my physical type, not my personality type exactly. So, t- to be honest, I didn't really handle it right, I just kind of ghosted him and Left it at that. Oh, um, June, no. Oh, June. Oh, June. Come on, June. 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 We have a I, hardcore. I didn't really know how to handle the conversation. I just was like, okay, hey, I'm my type. Moving on. You don't deserve um, this, man. You don't nope. deserve him. <laughs> Go on. I'm just being honest. Um, so, you know, thanks to social media a little bit, I've, you know, kind of been noticing how he moves. And he actually has a lot of the same values that I do. Um so it just got me thinking while I was on a date with this other guy that is my type, like maybe I kind of overlooked um, something great with Zach just because, I don't know, I, maybe I'm stuck in my ways. I'm guilty of it, I guess. June, but what I'm is like your hoping. particular type? Like when you say you went out with a guy who fits that, what does that look like? She's looking for guys that ghost women, <laughs> that share values. <laughs> <laughs> A little bit. Uh, he was super outgoing like I was. Um, very go with the flow, free-spirited. Um, just really, like, moves how he wants to move. And tall, of course. Um, <laughs> super <laughs> interesting. Of, of course, too. Oh, of I course. get it now. I get it now. Now Zach is a short king. I'm getting it. <laughs> now, Zach, it's not that Zach is, is short. He's like... A realistic height, if that makes sense. I think I what thinking, is a realistic height? No, please don't answer height. that. Yeah, define that. No, for don't us. define no. a realistic no. height. You're going to devastate me. People want to know. <laughs> what, is June, like? what is a realistic height exactly? My type is like six two and up, and that's just not wow. Like that. I get it, girl. I get it. <laughs> Anything under six two? Six two is very realistic, but what is that? <laughs> Six two and under is imaginary. I just <laughs> not face face the show and I hate all of it. Bert's her. our imaginary friend here. Are you uh, shaking? Hey, Bert, is your arm shaking right now? I, I, I'm not even here. Bert, you got to spin a positive uh, spin on this. Uh, you know, you're unreal. <laughs> oh, he's too good to be true. Right. Yes. Anyway, this isn't about me or heights, I June. I did it. All right, so this guy now is like legitimately. Now you're thinking like this. This is I, here's what's going to be working against you here, and we've already reached out to him so we'll have some answers for you here in a couple of minutes the ghosting aspect man is tough to get over i think yeah i, I dealt with it and yeah. um I, it only happened to me once and that was enough for me to never want to go through that again especially when you're really into the person and you, you're putting in the time and you really think it's going somewhere the fact that you can at least like you don't see enough in me to at least send me a text saying this is not working out it's, it's pretty hard to get over I think he's still going to be into her. You, you know, my philosophy, you can never say too little to a man to make him want you. Uh, she's she's gone that's, that's to the bar. max here. She has said absolutely nothing. That's a I, fact. Yeah. I, I wouldn't be surprised if Zach has been feeling like, June, you're the one that got away. Hold yeah. on. This is, that, that's good enough to actually repeat what you just said. You can never say too little to a man to make him watch you. That's why I just don't talk to boys. That though. is an absolute fact. <laughs> the truth, right? It is the truth. We had a co-host uh, on here one time that said, men are hunters, let them hunt. Mm-hmm. And it's sort of saying the same thing. Yeah. Um, all right. So... Um, you wanted us to reach out to him, see if A, he remembered you, B, if he would mm-hmm. even be interested in going right. ahead and going back out. And you're sure if this dude says, yes, this isn't like about the hunt here. Like, this isn't about 
him maybe coming back and saying, yeah, you know what, I would really like to go out with her. And then you thinking, oh, I just wanted him to say that he wanted to go out. And then you don't do anything with it, right? No, no. I really, I see the way he carries himself. I really did overlook a good thing, and I'm just really hoping that I can get a second time round. All right. Uh, hold on for us one second. Uh, Tommy already reached out to this dude and found out if he's still into it or not, so you'll have answers here in just a second, okay? The Burt Show.